Hello everyone, this is King 4 and I'm going to do a tutorial video. This is how to get started with some of the mods that will pretty much automate and pretty well make your starting a little easier. Now I'm going to start with thermal expansion because I find it the easiest to do. So first, I'm going to show you how to craft these three machines. The pulverizer, powered furnace, and sawmill. Now, for all of them, you will need... Hold on, I need the recipe this a redstone reception coil to make to make that you take redstone like this and you put gold here that's how you make it yeah you, know, you need it for all of these machines all of them now the rest is actually very simple now <coughs> the other thing that you'll need is a machine frame what you need to do is put oh i forgot iron Ooh, i thought i prepared um hold on you need iron is <sighs> sometimes i hate this okay you need iron at the corners, glass in between them, and then one gold, and that'll make a machine frame. Now you need it for all of them, and fail. Okay, let's make that. Okay, that's more than enough, but oh well. So now to make them. the uh, I'll start with the pulverizer. Oh, the pulverizer is made with... Um, machine frame, a piston, two flint, oh by the way copper is, it doesn't matter which copper, whether copper, copper ingots, these are just a couple different coppers, if I do this quickly, there's a copper here, a copper here, it doesn't matter which copper you have, usually it's this copper I think, so you put the copper like that, and then you put that, and that is a pulverizer, which is the same thing as this, and I'll get into that later. Now to do the powered furnace. Machine frame again. By the way, you need copper for our, I believe all of these. Copper. Bricks. You need bricks, so you need clay to make the powered furnace. Then you place a redstone and... What was the other thing? I'm drawing a blank. Hold on. What was the other thing? Uh, redstone? Oh, did not even know that. Okay. Well, I learned something new. Okay, so I need redstone. Ugh, so unprepared. Didn't even look at the recipe. Okay, you need one redstone, machine frame, redstone coil, two copper, and two bricks. That'll make you a powered furnace, which is the same as that. To make the sawmill, which is actually optional, but does have benefits in that, okay, um, not what I wanted to show. Where is it? You get sawdust, which makes, sorry, I actually don't know this. Compressed sawdust, which makes charcoal. Okay, good to know. Um, so to make this, you need an iron axe to any wood. Any wood except for force wood, which I'll make a thing later on that. Redstone coil, I believe copper, and machine frame. Yes, and you make a sawmill. So that's how you get started. Now, these do need power, as you can see here. They use buildcraft power, which I will make something for that later because quarries are really good. But you need a sterling engine. What? Well, you don't need a sterling engine, but redstone engines don't work, and these explode. The combustions explode. So this powers by coal. How to make them? I need now. Do I have enough stuff? No, I need coal. I need. Hold on. Okay. So first, you need. Eight sticks, eight sticks. You place them in a kind of like diamond to get wood gears. You surround them with cobblestone to get stone gears. And oh, actually, you don't need iron. Then you need to put them in a pattern like this. You need one piston, one glass in there, right there, and then three cobblestone and you get a sterling engine. Now you do need to give it a redstone signal and I just destroyed them so I will use saw no. Uh where is it? I wanna show you the pulverizer what it does. Okay. So pulverizer down. Sterling engine down. Redstone signal. Now get rid of all this. Next you need coal. Now this this mob pack you need tons of coal. So I hope 
that you didn't just waste all your coal because you need tons of it. Now you place it here and you power it and then it'll put power here. Now what the pulverizer does as I get some ore is in, when you smell an ore you get one ore usually but in this pulverizer if I can find ore where is ore? Ore. Oh. Get the ore is instead of one ore you get if it'll smelt so it's, it's smelting one so I have 32 now I have 31 and I put one in here and as it goes it's really slow with low power once it has max power it's faster but this doesn't really feel it quite well anyway once this is done you get two pulverized iron now powered furnace powered furnace side Powered furnace. <clears throat> I'm just gonna put it here for just because I need more coal. Where's the coal? That's in here. And I need another stir. Oh, here it is. Okay. Um, you do this again, and <clears throat> once you put the you put the pulverized iron in here as it powers. Hold on, it has to power so. Um, yeah, this takes a little bit to power. Um, oh, whoops. Oh well, doesn't matter. Come on, power. I might just put a power source in here just because I showed you this. Actually, you know what? I showed you that. I'm going to do something else. Um, I'm, by the way, this is way later in the game that I'm getting, if I can find it. And nerd. Gee. Ooh, that's not energy. That's not energy cell. This is way later in the game. This requires diamonds, but. What? Oh. Okay, sorry. I am very. Ugh. Hold on. What's it called? Oh, let's do this. Um, here we go. They're all redstone. Okay. I am very unorganized today. But yeah, this is going to be a lot faster. And, oh, I hate that. Okay, no. This goes out. And that goes in. And now it powers. And I put... It's so now it gives me two. And I will show again. Actually, I'm going to power it like this again. I showed you how that works. So yeah. Um, okay, so one ore disappears, by the way. Don't know why. Just does. How much hard does this use? Okay, a lot. Gives me two. And then you can do this. Although, you can do this part in a coal, like, a normal furnace. Like, you can. Or smelt the whole thing. Although, if you have a full stack in there, then it, you'll have to take the stack out because it does two. So, yeah. That's a thing you should watch out for. But, just do this. Oh, this is a lot slower. It does still work in here, obviously. So, yeah. So anyway, that is my first tutorial video on thermal expansion, which I think is better than industrial craft to start with because this takes a lot more resources and you need to find rubber, which is kind of hard to find sometimes. Anyway, I, <coughs> I was Yoshi King 4 and I hope this helped. Goodbye.